growing up as a kid here in, in South Seattle in the Rainier Beach neighborhood, you know, so often you heard about the death here, you heard about the crime. That was essentially you were told that's all you can either do or all you can either be because of the omission, the glaring omission of the life here. My name is Marcus Harrison Green. I'm the editor and a founder of the South Seattle Emerald, a nonprofit newspaper which covers South Seattle. I spent some time in California for a while uh, as a hedge fund manager, very much uh, different from what I do today, but I always had a love for storytelling. I always had a love for this area and it and both called me back. South Seattle is the most vibrant place in the world. I can go outside and, and smile at people and, and people will smile at me. If you go down to MLK, um, you'll see the East African community, the uh, East Asian community in the same same areas. Seward Park, nature and water, and it's really beautiful. The passion for storytelling and the passion for this area, putting them together in the South Seattle Emerald over the last two and a half years has been the most life-affirming experience I've ever, ever encountered. It's important to know that, that people can be a part of their media, that their voice, that their perspective is valued and that anybody can be a journalist or a writer. There's too much of the same voice. The platform that Marcus has been able to give people in South Seattle is for us to do our own reporting, citizen journalism. South End has the opportunity to use the voice of the newspaper for the community, by the community, to the community. We as neighbors are a link in a chain, and if we tighten our link, then we'll have a stronger community. If an emerald didn't exist, then I mean, you know, there would barely be any coverage in this area of South Seattle. At the Emerald, we've seen the effects and impact that neglect can have on an area, especially the neglect of a media. We don't take financing from any corporation. We don't take financing from huge businesses. We don't take financing from any huge foundations because we don't want to be beholden to a foundation or a corporation or a big business. We want to be beholden to who we are beholden to, and that is our community, solely and truly our community. We are asking you to donate to the Emerald, as every cent of it goes to a writer or an editor, either experienced or first time, who lives and, and works and, and loves here in the South End community. Join us in this quest to tell our story with our words and our voice.